Hey everybody, we're back here with the 2.2 Ecotech in the 05 Saturn. The head is on. Um, bolts are torqued down. And yes, I went Chevrolet orange with this. Um, I'm a firm believer in painting and I hate stuff to be painted black. I have not put these outside bolts in yet. Um, they are not really head bolts. Um, so I ain't really worried about them. Uh, they will be going in. Uh, the reason why I'm a firm believer in painting and painting in the bright colors like this instead of everything being black like it is now pretty much, um, you can see if there's a leak. I mean, you, it will stand out like a sore thumb if there is an oil leak on here. And too, I want this thing to be clean. Everybody had to look and say, oh yeah, he just recently put a head on this. And did a pile of other work. Uh, as soon as I get it on the road, I'm going to power wash all this down here. Get all this freaking oil off. Um, the only reason why I'm putting, not doing the time chain cover and all that today and worrying about that um i'm getting a new gasket for it it came off and looked perfect but i'm not taking a chance on it i'm gonna go ahead and put a new gasket on it because i do not want this thing leaking i don't want to have to mess with this thing for another 200,000 miles like i said it does have new alternator new starter brand new water pump and a new reworked head on here so um, this thing should be good for a while. Um, and that color just looks awesome to me. Um, with all the other stuff in here polished up, that the black and the orange will look good together with the coil packs up here, I think. So, yeah. She's coming along. Should be done with her by next week. Not going to rush it. I am going to set the coil pack in there because I don't have the plugs for it right now and I just don't want anything falling down in there. And I'm going to kind of cram some some uh, paper or something just uh, in the uh, injector holes so nothing gets down into cylinders. Because it could be four or five days before I get back out here again. And definitely don't want it raining down in it or anything. So, that's it. Oh, the head. Uh, it took me forever to find out where to torque these at. Um, the torque pattern is always working from the inside out in a circular motion. You do the, the inside ones and then you work out and keep going out in a circular motion like you do with any head. Uh, but it's everything I found said torque it to 22 pounds. And then from there... You want to have your degree wheel, or if you know degrees pretty good, I, just, I ain't got a degree wheel, no one's gonna go buy one. Uh, you need to degree it 155 degrees beyond that, which came out to roughly be about 70 pounds of pressure on it. Because I went back and checked it afterwards and they were right dead on 70 pounds after that. So, I mean, to me, if you actually just wanted to torque them, just torque them freaking 70 pounds. Um, so there you go. That, that doesn't seem like much to me for a head. It is 10 head bolts in this old aluminum head. So that's okay. I mean, my Oldsmobile, it was 120 pounds on each bolt. Um, so, okay, is what it is. All right, everybody. Y'all have a good one. Later.